Tonight, a major break in the case. A Chicago area father and son now federally charged for allegedly knowingly selling diseased body parts. The night team's Tara Molina here now. Tara, the feds honed in on one key link here. That link, Brad, a notorious Detroit body broker. His name is Arthur Rathburn. He's now in federal prison. Evidence collected in his case led the feds here to Donald Green Sr. and Donald Green Jr. We first broke this story in 2015. It's a story of precious cargo and broken promises that donated bodies would go to medical research. Promises allegedly made by Donald Green Sr. and his namesake, the father-son duo behind the now shuttered Biological Resource Center of Illinois. Those broken promises detailed here led the FBI to the center more than four years ago. That bodies and body parts weren't donated at all, but in some cases sold on the black market. Per a search warrant, a mother told her son's tissues would be donated to colleges and research centers. Instead, parts of him sold for $5,000. It goes on. Bodies known to have HIV, sepsis, and hepatitis kept on ice, then sold. Some for up to $100,000. United States attorneys repeatedly call it a scheme in the charges filed to defraud customers of the Biological Resource Center of Illinois. It's not illegal to dismember and broker body parts, per se. It is illegal to knowingly sell remains positive for infectious disease, like what's alleged the Greens did from 2008 to 2014. The federal document charging the Greens alleges the men sold to Detroit Medical Center's sports medicine department at least one specimen that, quote, had previously tested positive for hepatitis. This fact was concealed by Donald A. Green Sr.'s scheme to defraud. Green Sr. is charged with wire fraud. Junior faces a felony for intentionally concealing a crime.